Wow, that's a big family. A mother with three cubs. And she is good mother. It is rare to have three cubs, but even more rare to have them all survive. Let's memorize them, in case we see them again. Mother is not too big, with a long white colored nose. The biggest cub with whitish face almost rivals her in size. His smaller sibling has darker hair and longer legs making him look like a black bear. This is where we met this wonderful family, on the bank of the inlet, five kilometers from the lodge and about seven kilometers from the river where we normally watch bears fishing for salmon. It would be wonderful if they visit us on the river. Can they? This wouldn't be an easy walk, but the salmon would be well worth the effort. Next day we check out the river. Yes, there are very fresh bear tracks on the sandy bottom. More than one bear walked up the river, but how many? Hard to tell. Probably we should get back to the blind. Here they come. A mother and her one, two, yes, three cubs. It is the same family, the mother is not too big, her nose is light colored, one cub is bigger and has some more white hair on his face, another cub is dark and slightly resembles a black bear, sure these are the same four bears. They made it across the mountain and into the river, now they are ready to go fishing. It is not easy to catch a live salmon. Most attempts result in nothing but frustration. If you don't believe, just walk into a shallow river and try to catch a big slippery fish with nothing but bare heads. Fortunately, during the salmon run, there is enough dead or dying fish around. So, despite some growling between the competitors for a better piece, every bear on the river gets full stomach. 